Here's hoping this works. I don't know. Ha! Ha ha! Gotcha! You thought, buddy. You thought. Hello, my Twisted viewers, and welcome back to another episode of Subnautica Below Zero. Today's episode, I've got a new subscriber, so that means I've got a new resident for Subtropolis. I'm going to work on that room and get that room all set up for that new new subscriber. Uh, and if I have some time left over, maybe I'll, I'll do some work on the uh, the new residency for, uh, for Subtropolis. Uh, maybe I'll do some lights outside or some little things around around the base, but let's just dive right in. Alright, okay, so we're back in the base here, Subtropolis. Uh, in case you missed last episode, I did build a really long tunnel this way, uh, past the control room to a new area where I'm going to put uh, new residencies. Uh, we're going to get to that probably later. That's that's a little bit big big of a project, but right now we're putting a new room in for a new subscriber. Uh, pardon the way I say it, I think it's Michelle, uh, but I will try my best to write it the way it is, and if it's wrong, you can just correct me in the comments below. I am okay with being wrong. Alright, so first we're going to go to the resource center, which is over this way in the upper area of Subtropolis. I keep most of my inventory stuff there. I'm gonna grab a bunch of titanium. I wonder if I should have grabbed my truck. My sea truck to load up on stuff. Ooh, am I missing? Ooh. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do some uh, recyclotroning. Uh, it's five per ingot, so let's see here. One, two, three, four will give me 20. Okay, so 20 titanium should be Plenty to get things started, hopefully. Can I put all of them in? No, just one at a time. One at a time. Sweet. So now you get to see how the Recyclotron actually works. Which is a beautiful system <laughs> they've got here. Uh, the last uh, the last game, you didn't we didn't have this item. And it's a very, very handy, because then I can condense everything into titanium ingots, and I can, I can save on space and everything, so it's great, it's great, it's great. Ah, uh, okay, let's get my building tool out and see what I'm going to have to build. I need a bed, so I'll need fiber mesh, not a problem. Uh, ooh, there's a nice aromatherapy lamp. Maybe we'll get to doing that. Two titanium for the shower. So two, two, and two. So you need six titanium all together just for the, <laughs> the utilities. Um, okay, so let's get over to the residency over there all the way on the other side of the base <laughs> so let's let's hoof on over to that and uh, we'll see you there all right so i think i have everything here is the lobby to the residency and let's head on up to the top floor the penthouse all, right, all the way to the top please all right so we got some vacant lots here uh, we're going to put in our new resident here, and let me just make sure I'm spelling it correctly. I believe it was M-S-H-A-Y-L-L-E. I'm going to say that's Michelle, Mich Michelle, Michelle, I've, that's M Michael, Michelle, I'm so sorry. If uh, if I'm saying it wrong, please comment in the, in the section below, but I, I'm going to say Michelle, okay? So going forward, this will be your room. And now we got to figure out, let's get you a window. Let's get you a window in here. I want to be able to look out. And if this is any indication of where anything is, this will look on to the calf area. Get a window right here. Boop. Now you can see Subtropolis. Wow, look at that. That's so cool. I mean, this thing's a bit in the way, but that's fine. Whatever, right? Some some greenery, some trees in the way. Uh, we're going to get you a bed. Where are we going to put the bed? I'm going to give you a nice bed, Michelle. I'm going to give you Danielle's bed. That's a good one. Now, this is one that's actually my favorite bed. I like the red one. I just don't know where where to put your bed. Is this a good spot? Close to the window? To the window, to the wall. Cool, there we go, nice bed right off the side here. And 
we're gonna need stuff like uh, the shower and whatnot. But let's get a counter. Let's get a counter in here. I'm gonna offset it because I'm gonna put the sink with it. So offset that so I can plop in a sink. Maybe I should have pushed it over. That's fine. We'll we'll center everything out. Don't you worry. We're gonna get your room all set up, fully functioning, water and everything. Utilities are paid for here in Subtropolis. We have water aplenty. A little bit off, I think, but that's all right. That's not too bad. It's looking pretty good. So you got a nice counter and in, in sink there. That's cool. You can prep food and whatnot. Maybe I'll get you a nice fridge. Okay. Well, first off. You need, you need the, the basics. Um, so we're going to put it over here, I guess. Can I put them both next to each other, like the shower and the toilet? Let's see. I'm trying new things as I go here. I know it's by the door, but whatever. I can't section anything off. Yeah, let's get a shower in here, too. Shower time! Okay, I can't bring it that close, huh? as I can get it. Really? Just it seems like I should be able to push it back further. Is it because of this? Let me remove the toilet. Let's start with the let's start with the shower first. Cool. Alright, that's a little better. That's perfect. Okay, and we'll get hopefully the toilet will fit in here. Very, very snugly, but it'll work. Look at that. Look at that. You got this. Uh, what else can I toss in here? Can I give you a... I mean, if I wanted to, I can give you a, a fridge. Put the fridge over there, I guess. Uh, I'm going to put this here. Cool. And what's an aromatherapy cost me? Yeah. Well, I can't put it in there? That's sad. Well... Kind of hoping to. I'll put it on top of the bed. How's that? Nice aromatherapy lamp on top of your bed. The aromatherapy lamp oh. by Quasico can reproduce over 17,000 natural scents captured from hundreds of worlds. Wow, hundreds of worlds. So that that implies that there's like other other environments to to explore. I really I really like that concept. Uh, picture frame. How big can I get this? If I put this, this will be like the TV. How's that? We can pretend this is a TV. It's <laughs> a nice big picture frame there for you. Um, do I have enough for a friggin' fridge? Look at this. Look at this. This is like... This is the Cadillac of, of rooms up here. This is the penthouse room for sure. Man, I'm, I'm packing a lot into this room and it's looking pretty good. I mean, that's not too bad. That's not too, too bad. Uh, what else can I toss in your room here? Do I have enough titanium for stuff? Ooh, a glass table? No. Maybe. A place to eat. Where would you eat? Right over here. Nice glass table. I don't know if... Hmm. Hmm. I'm thinking things over indecisive I'm I'm, <laughs> I'm like it's more feng shui over here that was offset but whatever looks good that way whatever uh move this over a little bit I wish I could pick pick items up instead of having to deconstruct everything but that's okay I don't know if I'll get two chairs in here I'll you'll probably only be able to get one in put the chair here so it looks like you can sit on it can I sit? Nice. Look at this! Would you look at this? This is an actual place. This could be livable. This could be livable. You know what? If I've got some titanium left, I'll, I'll even put some full, some lamps, or sorry, some foliage on the wall. Some nice wall plants. Look at this. This is like legit turning out to be a nice place. Wow, wow. Cool. Now I'll just have to get you some stuff for it. I got some nice vase plants downstairs. I'll, I'll pop in here for you. 
Uh, can I put a green wall over here? I would like to get the green wall, but I guess I gotta push this back. It's a little nicer. A little nicer to sit at, right? Let's come in here. You can sit down. And now we'll sit. Look at this. Look at this. It's like a real place. This is like fully furnished. I got, I got a fridge and everything in here. Man. Michelle, you're doing great. You're on the top floor of Subtropolis. And we got two more rooms left up here. So if anyone else wants a, wants a room up here, uh, by all means, subscribe to the channel and I will build you a room. If I can see your name, then I'll build you a room. Unfortunately, if you have your name uh, hidden, I can't build you the room. Uh, but that's that's okay too. I do appreciate the subscription if you do, if you do subscribe. Regardless, either way... I'm gonna sleep here in this bed. Uh, all right, all in a day's work, all in a day's work. Let's see here, now that I've done the unit for my new subscriber, let's see what else I can do with the new residency area. I'm probably gonna grab some glass from upstairs. I'm gonna make some glass tunnels along the way to the new residency. That way it's a little more open. It's not as uh, claustrophobic. All right, I'm gonna try and put a hatch somewhere here so that I can easily go in and out and uh, work on the, the tubes. All right, let's put it over here. I've got this hatch here <laughs> and this is the room. So let's put the hatch somewhere over here. Let's just get a an entrance here. I will move it later. Just need something to get in and out. Hey Jerry, how's it going? Hanging out. So this is the long mile tube that I've got here, but let's try and change some of it up. Let's change some of this up. Deconstruct. That one, take this one off. Pop one of these bad boys in. Look at that, look at that. Nice, nice see-through thing. Now, and negative two to my hull strength. I wonder if I should offset them. Let's offset these. What? Oh, I'm missing glass. Oh yeah, gotta go get some glass from upstairs. Uh, bear with me, I'll be right back. All right, all the way back. Okay, so let me switch up my tools here. I've already got it here, so let's finish. Boop. Deconstruct one over here. I'm gonna have to put some re- re Oh, inventory full. So it got like one more component left. Uh, bugger. Ah, uh, bugger. What the heck am I gonna do about that? I know what I'll do. Just a quick little drop off here. If I build a container, lickety split. It doesn't matter where it is, just boop. Now I've got room for stuff. I mean, or I'll toss a couple of these in there. Just so I got room. Back at it. Gone and let's put the glass tube. Beautiful, beautiful. Got one more here I can do. Should have grabbed some rubber while I was at it upstairs. I can put a bulkhead. I have to put some bulkheads. I'll reinforce this bad boy. Okay, so it probably won't look as bad now. Not like a claustrophobic tunnel, but at least there's some like... Yeah, I can see outside. Ah, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. I gotta start building like stuff that's higher. Then I can, I can see all that. I'll leave these here for like reinforcements. Jerry's having a good time up there. Maybe we'll start building higher levels up over this way. Uh, but what do we got here? What do we got? Some 
titanium. Can we build it? How am I gonna build it? The other one I had a lot of multi-purpose rooms. Can I build maybe an L-shaped tunnel on this side? best suits what I need to do here. Why can't you do this? Why can't you do? Because the grass? Is the grass giving you a problem? Of course, I can do it up here. How am I going to do? How am I going to do? Let's do... Like this. Okay, so technically I should be able to put like these things on it, right? Bonk. Let's see it. So this will be like a stair up, I guess. I don't even know if that's what I want to do. Is this look a little silly to people or what? Oh, ah, nope. I don't want any, Dave. Your lily paddlers are getting too friendly. If I build a tube. How much how much friggin' titanium do I have? I've only got a little bit left. Hmm. That's kinda cool. Plop another glass one on here. Really? He's gonna do some stilts? Sure, why not? I mean Looking good. How many of these can I have? I can only do two of them. The thought is I'm gonna put it like a thing that goes up here. Who knows? Well or maybe I'll make it come out this way so I don't have as much foliage in the way, but I'm gonna need to re thirty seconds Whoa. of oxygen remaining. I'm gonna have to reinforce this thing. So I need to build some reinforcements. How do I do this? Three titaniums and one lithium per enforcement. I can do four. That's uh, 12. 12 titanium and four lithium. So give me a minute, I gotta go get some resources. And I'll be right back. All right, so I got all the resources for the enforcements. Let's just, uh, let's line this, uh, this bad boy with some, some reinforcements. See how high we can get the hull integrity. Boop. 16. 23. I mean, I could also put... I would like to put maybe some green space in there. That'd be real nice. I haven't done this way, so let's do some here. Boy, if I ever have to move any of this, it's going to be a heck of a job. All right, so I'm up to 37.3 hull integrity now. So I should be okay for a little bit whilst building the new residence. Um, what do I gotta find out? I gotta find out how much titanium I have. Probably need more. All right, and I got a bit of glass in case I wanna get adventurous. Put some glass on there, but let's do this faster this way. Okay, so here's a question. If I wanted to put a multi, yeah, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Cool, I like it. So now I can put another one on top of here, right? I don't know if I'll have uh, <laughs> have enough for the ladder, but if it's anything like my other my other residency, I'm gonna have to build a couple things here. I really gotta do resource gathering just so I can like fill in these spaces with like, you know, foliage and whatnot. I'm one short for another another uh, multi-purpose. So let's put some ladders in. Welcome aboard, Captain. Whoops. Whoops. Oh, I guess I gotta put the ladder in. Yikes. I thought it came with a ladder. My bad. So I have more ladders to build. I mean, that seems fine, right? Boop. Glad it goes all the way. 
That's sweet. I will have to build another one here. Two titanium? Man. Why can't I turn it? I want to turn it. I don't want it to face that way. Ah. Ah. Fine. You win. You win. Oh, maybe I should put some glass in here, huh? Maybe I should get some windows going. Nice window there, I guess. Is that nice? It's not, not as nice as I'd like it to be, to be honest with you. No, it's not too bad. If I put an outdoor grow bed here, maybe I can put some cool stuff there. Who knows? I'm just going to load this up with glass, and then I'll take whatever I don't want out. Ah, that's got a thing in it. It's not looking too bad. I just gotta, I just gotta get some more titanium on this. So I'll be right back. <laughs> All right. So hopefully I've got everything I need for at least the stairs. <laughs> I'm gonna try and put some uh, green walls along the uh, the glass hallway to this uh, residency. Should make for a cool, cool looking hallway. I really wish I could have turned that tried as much as I could. Is there another one? No. Didn't think I had another one up here. Um, window, please. It's not bad. That's not a bad view. Let's put another one here. No, that is cool. I could, uh, maybe I could put the grow beds on top here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if it's even possible. Exterior grow bed. Can I put? Yes, I can. Oh, yeah. The grow bed lets you Whoa. grow plants and vegetables, providing flavorful options for evading scurvy. Okay, cool, cool. I was just going to put some cool plants in here and see how it goes. Uh, I'm going to put two, I guess, and see what kind of plants I can get in here. This is going to be real neat, actually. I, I just wish I had infinite <laughs> infinite resources. The, the problem is, is next episode is probably going to be a resource gathering episode where I adventure out into the wilderness uh, and try my luck with that. Okay, cool. If I had like a whole bunch going that way, it'd be real neat. So I'm going to put that there for now uh, as a placeholder, like kind of come back to this later if I can. Do I have any titanium left? I do. Thank goodness. Oh, going through it so fast. It's just like, wow. Uh, I want the green walls, please. I want these here. What? What do you mean? What do you mean, no? There you go. <laughs> like, what do you mean? So there's like a sweet spot in here. Oh, okay, there you go. That's fine. It's looking good. Man, that looks pretty dope. That's pretty sweet. Coming across here, making it feel good. Can I put a bulkhead here? Is this possible? Do I have enough for a bulkhead? Bulky. Yes, 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 yes. Nice. It's all sealed off now, so if it floods, I don't have to worry too much about that. That's delicious. <laughs> uh, let's see. Excellent. Okay, well, this is coming along. I think I'm going to put a pin in this for a second. I wanted to put some floodlights outside uh, where my sea truck is so I can see if I can even do it. Let's see here. Where are my floodlights? Do they even exist anymore? Do floodlights, are they a thing? They are. Glass and titanium. All right. So let's give this a shot. I'm going to go put these out uh, where the sea truck is so I can see where all my uh, my vehicles are parked. Okay, so it's nighttime now. I uh, should be able to see how the floodlights are going to work over by the moon pool here. I got what I need. Hopefully, Henry the Brute Shark doesn't mess with me. Uh, where do I want to put these? So like if I Let's pop one on the corner here. Let's have a, let's have a gander and see what this looks like. Let's give it a shot. No power to it. Is that how this works? All right. So here's hoping this works. Uh, I don't even know if the floodlights are in the right direction. 
I don't know how this transmitter thing works. Is there any power? How do you how do you flood light? Power transmitter. Is it because they don't have power close by? Like I don't know. It's not very clear. So here's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set them up regardless if they work or not. I'm gonna set them up in an area where I think I'm gonna want them. And uh, we'll go from there. Here's hoping this works. I don't know. Ha! Ha ha! Gotcha! You thought, buddy. You thought. This is where you live now. And I would really love for the power stuff to come here. How does this work? Power train extends the range of power source. Thermal plane. Like, do I do I have to put this next to my thing? I'm so confused. Let's. Not sure where to put this thing. <laughs> I'm wondering if I can just like plop it over here. We are learning things. Okay, so there's that. So maybe if I go and put it in my power source up here. My other closest power source is all the way at the uh, the other residency. So my only, my closest power source is up here. Plop this on top. Does that help any? Like I don't I don't see it doing much. Plopped another antenna over here. I, I'm assuming it's an antenna of sorts, so plop this in here. I didn't think so. How do you work? Yeah, I'm not too sure. I think I'm gonna have to put like a power source down here uh, to get these floodlights to work. I'm not 100% sure how this is gonna work. Uh, these uh, these transmitters aren't doing what I thought they would do, so. I don't know, I got some adventuring to do, I gotta do some, a whole bunch of resource gathering, uh, do some adventuring out in the world. Uh, but, if you like this episode, hit that subscribe button. If you want to get notified every time I upload a video, usually every Mondays and Fridays, hit that bell notification, and we'll catch you in the next adventure. Bye!